Hello, everybody, and welcome to today's webinar on Salesforce Document Management 2.0, Smarter, Faster, and Better. I am Soumya Muttukumar, a product consultant here at Septis, and with me is David Christopher, a lead consultant. Hello, everyone. Thank you all for joining in today. I am super excited for today's webinar, and I'm looking forward to sharing a lot of insights with you all. Before we start today's webinar, let's talk about Septis. Septis is a summit partner of Salesforce, which is the highest level of partnership that any company can have with Salesforce. We're not only a summit partner, but we're also a partner MSP and a PDO partner. We're also authorized cloud resellers, and we are available on the App Exchange. Here is our wall of fame. In the past few years, we've won multiple awards and recognitions from Salesforce. We've won the Partner Innovation Awards 2022, as well as 2023, as well as APAC Partner of the Year Award 2022 and 2023. We're waiting on our third one. We're a three-time Demo Jam winner as well. When we talk about Septis, we have 250 plus employees, out of which 90 plus percent of them are certified. We have five offices in India, offices in Dubai, as well as in the US. We have 10 plus products, out of which seven are listed on the App Exchange. We, we have been in this industry or Salesforce industry for the last 15 plus years. We have 1,000 plus customers and five star rating on all of our apps on App Exchange. We have also have a 4.9 on five CSAT score. Before we start with our webinar, let's talk about the three key aspects that we're going to talk about in today's webinar. That's right. Unlike the pyramid scheme, we have three key aspects that we will look at today. First, we will talk about how to automatically generate a document within Salesforce using X Files Pro. Second, we will show you how storage integration works with X Files Pro and how useful it is. Third, we will also see how document sharing and collaboration is done with these using our application. That's exactly right. But before we begin, I'm sure there are a lot of hidden hurdles in the document management of Salesforce that none of us talk about. Let's be honest, manually uploading these files can be a bit of a tedious task. It can work, of course, but there's always a risk of getting things disorganized. And on top of that, juggling manual uploads opens doors to potential security risk. Oh, and let's not forget the collaboration headaches. Before we started using X-Files Pro, this was a constant source of frustration for David and I as well. We would keep requesting the marketing team for the same files over and over again, only because we couldn't easily locate it within Salesforce. But don't worry, X-Files Pro has got your back. Using our advanced, automated, and smart features, you can easily collaborate on the files, also increasing your security and accessibility. Oh, and let's not forget the management's or every management's constant worry about a better ROI. Now let's jump right into document generation with X-Files Pro. That's right. Now looking at document generation, here are a few key points to look at. Using template management, here you can easily manage your templates like proposal, NDA, invoice, and so on. You can import pre-built templates to Salesforce or build a customized template within Salesforce. And when it comes to review and approval, you can set the hierarchy level for the document to get previewed and approved as well. Now that you have the document ready, but are you wondering who has access to this document? Well, with access control, you can now control which user gets to generate which type of documents. For example, you don't want the sales team to get access to generate the HR document like an onboarding form, right? Plus, we also support e-sign you can automate the e-sign process without using any third-party application within Salesforce. Now let's see how easy it is to generate a document in Salesforce. Somia, over to you. David, thank you so much for giving that information. 
Let's watch this short clip on how we can generate a document in Salesforce using Xpulse Pro. As you can see, I have considered Elite Synergy Dental Care with multiple fields under it. Under the details, you can see there is the lead source, the company name, the product that they've used, maybe a probiotic mouthwash, an electric toothbrush, the amount that has been paid, the amount that is remaining to pay, the lead source, the lead status, the shipping city, the shipping street, all of the, all of the fields that are available within your sales force. Now, how to generate a quote? Using the generate quote option, you can select a template. You can select a template of your choice. Over here, we're choosing a proposal, but you can choose invoice, NDA, proposal, or any template of your choice. It will not be an issue at all. To generate this proposal, now you can click on next. Once you click on the finish button, your proposal will be generated and will be stored in the file storage of your Salesforce org. Let's see how that will be done. Finish and click on the refresh button. As you can see, the proposal that we generated is now available in the file storage of your Salesforce org. Wow, that was quick, Somya. That now that we know the process. Yes, now that we know how easy it is to generate the document, I'm sure we're going to start generating hundreds of documents, right? That's very true. Now that we know how easy it is to generate these documents, now your constant worry is going to be if you're going to be able to generate so many documents in your Salesforce org, how are you going to manage your file storage? This is exactly why we have brought in storage integration with Sales X Files Pro. Let's see how that is done. Yo, we can help you save 80% cost by just keeping your Salesforce file storage at bay. Well, when it comes to centralized storage, you can store all the documents under one roof where it's super organized. In auto file export feature, files from Salesforce can be automatically exported to your preferred external storage, which helps you reduce Salesforce file storage cost and it's a game changer and talking about large files i'm sure we all have a lot of large files in salesforce here we can help you move tbs of large files on the go thinking about where to move them well we have multi-cloud support like sharepoint google drive s3 and onedrive oh you don't need any third-party connector here again this helps you save extra cost now somia is going to show how storage integration looks like in Salesforce. Yes, sure. Now let's take a look at how storage integration works with Salesforce. As you can see, we have integrated our Salesforce org with SharePoint. As mentioned by David, you can integrate it with Amazon S3, OneDrive, Google Drive, or SharePoint. But just as an example, we have taken SharePoint. We have integrated our Salesforce org with SharePoint as seen. Now using our component document collaboration, we can easily upload files or view files within Salesforce. Let's say that some of your teams don't have access to the Salesforce org and have access only to SharePoint. Those teams can upload all of the files in that SharePoint and those files will be available in the same record in your Salesforce. Let's see how that's done. As you can see, we're in SharePoint. We're uploading files, any files that it may be. Over here, we're uploading purchase order, invoice copy, and warranty information. Once these files are uploaded in SharePoint, these same exact files will be visible in your Salesforce org. Let's see how that's done. Let's move to Salesforce. As you can see in your Salesforce, if you refresh, all of the files that we uploaded in SharePoint will be visible in your Salesforce. This is exactly what we mean by seamless integration. All of your files that you upload on SharePoint will be easily visible with no issues at all. Now that we have your files uploaded in Salesforce, you might be wondering, you want to give access to some people, some users, or you want to collaborate on those files. 
Let's see how we can do this access and collaboration with X Files Pro. That's right. You might be worried about how a lead or an opportunity will be mapped to your external storage. Well, you don't have to worry about it. Using a folder structure option, you can view it exactly as it is in your Salesforce org. Now looking at file and folder syncing, as shown in the previous video, files and folders get auto synced in Salesforce and in your external storage, which makes life so much easier. Your access control and secured sharing go hand in hand. Since you get to control on which user gets to access which files, it becomes super secure to share the files to an internal user or an external vendor. Now we will show you how you can easily locate the files in Salesforce using metadata tag. Sure. Now let's take a look at this clip. As you can see, using our document collaboration option, you can easily select the file and download it as per your convenience. The files will be downloaded from your Salesforce org to your computer to access. As you can see, it has been downloaded to the computer. Now let's say that you want to share this file to one of your users or for some purposes, for some business purposes, using this share option, you can click on it, select the user profile, user or profile and select the user. You've chosen Gagan and click on share. That's how easily you can share a file or document within the users of your company. Now that you've shared the document, you might be wondering, you are going to have 100 plus files under one record. How are you going to search through these files? What you can do is tag those files based on a type. Over here, we're tagging the first file under MSA. And using our search option, you can search only for the certain types of files. For example, let's search MSA. As you can see, all the files under MSA will be visible here. That was super easy and helpful. Now, just a quick recap on today's webinar. In document generation, we saw the benefits of template management and access control. And in storage integration, we showed how you can reduce the Salesforce file storage using X Files Pro. And with access and collaboration, we saw how easy it is to keep all the files organized and readily accessible. I hope all the three aspects of today's webinar was insightful. Right, David. Thank you so much for giving us a summary of what we learned in today's webinar. But before we end this webinar, I want to say a few things. Apart from our flagship product, which is X Files Pro, that we spoke about in today's webinar, we have various other products and services that we provide. As we spoke about X Files Pro, a document generation and eSign application, a storage and collaboration application. Now that your files are taken care of, let's see what we can do with your data. You might be wondering, you might be exceeding the data limits of your Salesforce org. You might be wondering, how can I buy extra storage from Salesforce since it's not that pocket friendly? Don't you worry, we got you. Using our data archiver and archiving application, you can archive all of your data. We have two types of archiving applications. It may be your native archiving or your external archiving. When we talk about native archiving, you can archive all of your data into big objects. And when we talk about external archiving, you can archive all of the data into an RDBMS of your choice. And let's not forget, we're the only native archiving application available on App Exchange. If you're actively using your Salesforce org, you're going to want to take a backup of the data in your Salesforce org because you never know when a human error can occur and some of the important data might be deleted. So using our data backup application, you can easily do that. We also have a seeding application. Now let's say that your team is using WhatsApp, Slack, any of your personal instances or any dialers in order for your business to run. We have an application for that as well. You can easily integrate all of your external third party applications with our application use called 200OK. 
It is a no-code native integration tool. And all of you real estate firm members, we have an application called Realty 360, which will help you easily with the process of your real estate end to end. When we talk about our services, we have various services that we provide. As we mentioned earlier, we're an MSP partner, a PDO partner, as well as an SI partner. We can take care of any of your product developments, advisories, your ISP Force app, platform, Heroku, anything of that sort. When we talk about SI, we can help you implementing sales cloud, CPQ, revenue cloud, service cloud, marketing cloud, Einstein AI, Tableau, which is one of the most used applications these days for data analysis, and even MuleSoft, which is a very famous application for your integrations. Thank you so much for attending today's webinar. But before we end this webinar with the Q&A, we have some exciting news to share. Our team will be at the London World Tour Salesforce this year. And we're excited to meet all of you. We'll be at our booth, X-Files Pro. I see a lot of questions coming in uh, from people. We're going to answer a few questions. And let's see. Um, so we have a question from Claire. Um, Claire is asking, how about the security of your application since we live in the European region? Um, David, would you like to take this question? Sure, Samya. Hey, Claire, thank you for the question. Uh, to answer your question here, uh, since you have complete control over who gets access to the files and documents, it is super secure here. And you also have entire control over your infrastructure and it's completely owned by you, Claire. So you don't have to worry about any kind of security threats. That's right. Thank you so much for answering that question, David. David is totally right. Since the infrastructure is yours and you can choose who accesses the documents, there is no worry about security using X-Files Pro. Um, I see a second question uh, from Ben about how you can meet us at the tour. Uh, so hi, Ben. Thank you so much for your question. Um, we'll be at the event. We'll have a um, booth at the event called X-Files Pro. We'll be there throughout the event. We can answer any questions related to X-Files Pro or any of our products that you might be interested in. Um, I see another question from Sarah. Do you support FSL? Yes, Sarah, thank you so much for that question. Uh, of course, yes, we do support FSL. We also support community licenses and other third-party applications like Litify, Revanova, and AVSite. Oh, and if you're worrying about, let's say your team is using the Salesforce One app very frequently, we also support the Salesforce One app. So you have no worries about that. Uh, all of the other questions will be answered over email. Thank you so much for joining today's webinar. I hope it was insightful. Thank you everyone for being part of today's webinar. We will keep you all posted on our upcoming webinars and we look forward to seeing you there. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye-bye.